New at 10, financial struggles hit the Salvation Army and it's impacting kids. 41 Action News reporter Tom Dempsey uncovers how and shows us why staff members are praying help come soon. It gives the kids a safe, climate-controlled place to come for at least a couple hours a day. As an instructor at the Salvation Army, Antonia Diaz knows the importance of the summer program. This program definitely does help keep a lot of these kids out of trouble um, because otherwise they're just roaming around doing whatever. The Salvation Army offering children, many from low-income families, things to do and a meal during the day. But this year, the summer program could be impacted. The Red Kettle campaign falling 10 to $15,000 short in independence. We provide snacks for them. We provide supplies for them. We don't ask money for money from the parents. So when donations are low, that can be difficult to provide. This financial shortfall even stretches to the bread line, which as you can see, remains very empty. The Salvation Army now hoping more help comes forward. For Major Ken Shields, the food pantry highlights some of the concerns. Uh, that would have been soup. And canned vegetables, those are always still important. For the first time in a long time, we're turning people away, uh, people that we just cannot possibly help. The Salvation Army now hoping for donations during a usually slow time of the year. But the fact of the matter is we get to this time of the year and uh, people may kind of forget who we are and what we're doing. A shortfall leading to concerns with Antonia Diaz knowing any donation will go far for families and children. All they need is someone who cares because some of these children don't even have that. Tom Dempsey, 41 Action News.